It was Asia Capital Markets Day at the London Stock Exchange and the aim to grow awareness of the investment opportunities for both British and Asian investors, forging even stronger ties. And the morning started with market opening, attended by the Indonesian ambassador to the UK and a delegation of senior figures from banking, regulation and finance from Indonesia. I'm absolutely delighted to be welcoming you all here to celebrate and kick off the start of uh, what we think is an incredibly important day, which is the Asia Capital Markets Day. I see this as yet another building blocks in the um, overall bilateral relationship between Indonesia and the UK. Both of our leaders agreed to uh, really strengthen the relationship further and I'm um, trying to elevate this to a higher level. London has many qualities that Asian investors are looking for. I mean, deeply liquid markets, a very advanced legal and regulatory system, so um, it's a place that investors feel comfortable putting their money. Um, equally, Asia are fast-growing markets, so uh, European investors are looking for access to the companies in those markets. Part of what today is about is, is getting those two sides together. There's a perception that uh, uh, companies that are earlier on in their evolution uh, have a, a, a find a, a, a better audience somewhere like London uh, than maybe they do in Asia. Nur Haider, the chief executive of the Indonesian Financial Services Authority and in charge of capital markets supervision and regulation, spoke about the strength of the Southeast Asian economy and Indonesia's extraordinary growth. Last year, our economic growth is 6.2%. Uh, higher than the average growth of Southeast Asian countries. In the area of capital market itself, our stock market indices has increased on the average about 20% per year since 2009. She also detailed the strategies to simplify procedures and regulation, but without sacrificing investor protection. We also have to increase the number of investors. So we believe that investors will, become to, will come to our market if the market is fair, orderly, and uh, transparent. I think this openness uh, is something that is, is welcomed uh, in, in the UK. Uh, it's clearly uh, of utmost importance to us to have a good, solid foundation, a good, solid relationship with our counterparts in other countries. We share the same goals. We share the, share the same challenges. Uh, we're very interested in helping their companies really open up uh, to global investors. And that's something that can't be done in isolation. It needs to be done together. The more you have these events, the more people uh, have dialogue and build relationships, um, the less barriers there are and the more people are comfortable investing in, in uh, places other than, than Europe. Uh, the partnership or cooperation between UK uh, regulators and also uh, in the country and Indonesia is going to be uh, very good for a global economy uh, development. The delegation from Indonesia is a particularly strong one. Uh, Valbury Capital's involvement has been uh, instrumental. Uh, so clearly, you know, we, we're very pleased with the results of today. Uh, we feel that, uh, you know, certainly in the case of Indonesia, that we've really helped to raise the profile of that country and those corporates uh, among the audience, the institutional investor audience and advisor audience today.